fun-loving Keely is willing to bend over backwards to find her man. When I go out, I'm possibly a little bit too loud. Got a limber up here. And then I end up doing something that I find quite funny. Oh no. The crab. Maybe this behaviour is making all the nice ones run a mile, so I need to, like, stop. And I'm stuck. <laughs> How do you get down? Uh, usually someone grabs me. I used to like, you know, the loudest bloke in the pub, I just, he'd have my attention, but now I sort of like someone who's a bit more reserved because possibly they've got a lot more to say. Pino, oh, thank Bridget. you. Need that, yeah? I do need it. Thank you. How are you feeling? Oh, I've been all right, but sitting here waiting, looking at the door, my nerves are going. So if you could have Mr Dream Man sat here, what's the ideal? Dark hair. Dark eyes, biceps. <laughs> and personality. Normally I go for like loud, cheeky, and all the rest of it. Does that feel a bit comfy? Yeah. Not bad. So maybe a lad, but who knows how to be a gentleman as well? Yeah. Dressed to impress, market trader Ben is armed with the gift of a gab. Bit of a cheeky chappy. Hello, sweet cheeks, you all right? <laughs> Can I have a look at this? <laughs> I mean, I've got to put it up to them, see if it suits them. You know, it's all playful fun. Most of the girls like it. Oh, my God. How would you rate yourself out of ten? Uh, five. Five out of ten. Oh, it's horrible. That's yeah. very low. That's yeah. ridiculous, yeah. Six. No, seven. Eight. So how long have you been single for? Three and a half years now. Really? That's a long time. Oh, yeah, but I've got two kids. So have I. So I have you? Yeah, I've got two boys, yeah. How often do you see them? I see them about three times a week, so... Oh, yeah. often then? Yeah, as much as I can. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. nice. Well, my problem is, I just don't go on dates. Now, say I'm out, I will meet someone yeah, and they will ask my number. Oh, yeah. Well, you're a beautiful girl. Oh, thank you. These men just talk to me. Yeah. They don't ask to take me out. I don't get it. Maybe they're intimidated by no, me. No. That can't be it. <laughs> I'm no. a nice girl. It's gorgeous, though, so... You can have that effect on some people. How long have you been single? About five years. I mean, I've had a few relationships since then, but I was in a long-term relationship, so... How old are we talking? We're talking school times, yeah, we're talking school. I sort of knew her from, from a young age, but we didn't really do anything for a little while, and then we got to, like, that curious age, and then, yeah, it was like... Had kids with her, oh yeah. We was childhood sweethearts, grew up together, and, you know, you look in someone's eyes, you know, say love at first sight. I'm a true believer of that. But, um, started to notice something wasn't right. I think what it was is we was together so long, I think she wanted to experience other things and different people then. It just wasn't working, so that was it. Oh, God, that's bad. It was bad, yeah. It just shattered me. It just feel like a broken mirror. The mirror smashed and I was just there trying to pick up the pieces and put, put myself back together again, you know what I mean? That's exactly how it felt, yeah. But what are you like now? Do you get on? We do get on. Like, it has to be that way because of the children, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want my kids to see us arguing and stuff no. like that. I've got respect for us. I do miss the family unit in that sort of sense. I think that's what I'm sort of searching for still. Do you think you'd have more? Uh, yeah, I, you know, you never know what's around the corner. Yeah. First impressions, what you think? What of the... <laughs> of... <laughs> what are you asking? You want a restaurant? Me? Yeah, yeah, you know, you seem nice. Oh, didn't you seem nice. Last night, last night. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.